That's right, you and it really was. I mean, Graham, it really was star-studded. And I think that Oriel Hayes should actually have been a part of it because she can represent us any day and twice on Sundays. So amazing she actually is. So hosted by supermodel Heidi Klum, this year's MTV EMA Awards uh, took place last night in the city of Frankfurt, Germany. It really was an amazing show with mind-blowing performances and, of course, jaw-dropping outfits. Our very own Hollywood reporter, Jen Sue, was there and joins us live on the telephone to, of course, dish out all of the gossip from last night's show. Good morning, Jen Sue. Good morning, Leanne. How are you? Great. Oh, my goodness. It's been so exciting in Frankfurt. Um, the best male yes. winner was Justin Bieber. Wow. Now, he was the winner. Of, uh, he had to post a thank you message by video. Yeah. Millions of fans voted for him. Uh, he was also a big winner in the terms of best pop act and also best world stage performance. Wow. But interesting, he wasn't there to collect it in person. Maybe it had something to do with his breakup with Selena Gomez. Oh, yes. Which sort of hit, you know, worldwide headlines yesterday, too. Um, he also had a bit of a concert in Brooklyn, so he was also busy with that. Okay. There was Taylor Swift. Also a big winner of the night, Best Female. Ooh. Taylor Swift ended up being the big winner of the evening. She won Best Female, she won Best Live Act, and Best Look. Nice. Now, and it this... was her first ever EMA, so, yep. you know, she was actually the big surprise. I mean, Rihanna came in with six nominations, came away empty-handed. Lady Gaga, also up for three, got zero. So this was a big night for Taylor Swift. Moving on to best song was Carly Rae Jepsen with Call Me Maybe. And um, she thanked Justin Bieber for making her an internet sensation. <laughs> I really was the year of internet sensations for the EMAs. Yeah. And Carly Rae received the, uh, the award from Kim Kardashian, who tripped on stage on the way to present, but uh, oh, kind of got herself together. <laughs> but yes, Carly Rae Jepsen looked good. I thought her bangs were a little bit too long, but she could like trim them an inch. Um, then you move on, Leanne, to Psy and Gangnam Style, which was best video. Woo. They have had, at that, at yesterday's tally, over 700 million hits on YouTube. Who knows, maybe it's even 800 million now. It's just wow. unbelievable the way that this video has gone viral to this degree. And his performance was awesome. It was the first time a South Korean ever performed at the MTV EMAs. Awesome. He thanked his wife of six years. So wow. Sai is married. Sorry, girls. Oh, sorry, I know girls. you were looking out for him. <laughs> <laughs> um, and he had a really awesome performance mm. with lots of look-alike dancers. David Hasselhoff did a little cameo. He was awesome. Moving on to best performance. Fun. Uh, we are young. They did that one featuring Janelle Monet. It's an American band. It's the first single from the second studio album called Some Nights an indie pop alternative rock track that actually, you know, caught, caught on fire, so to say. It was featured in the hit series Glee, and then a little bit later on in a commercial at the Super Bowl, so that was pretty big for fun. Then you move on to Heidi Klum. Uh, her red carpet, she, first of all, she wore six outfits wow. through the whole MTV Europe Music Awards. Yes, you and I would have loved that. Amazing. Leanne, changing all those outfits. Incredible, I love that. Um, and she wore this very, you know, laced up blue and gold shaded Versace gown on the red carpet. She wore lots of Versace. My only comment about Heidi Klum was her voice. It was very squeaky, a little bit too high pitched. Oh my God! Oh my God! You know, it was a little bit too much. I think yeah. if she toned down her voice a little bit, a little lower, a little bit more, you know, a little more mature, I think it would have been better. Okay. Taylor Swift looks amazing on the red carpet. She uh, won best female, best live, best look. Wow. And Taylor Swift was on the red carpet with the red carpet with a cream and beige sheer beaded v-neck gown uh, by Jay Mendel. It was stunning. I thought wow. she just looked very much the package. You know, for a 22-year-old girl, she really has it together. Even after her breakup with Connor Kennedy, she's looking awesome. And she performed amazing, you know. We will never, ever, ever get back together. Love she just that. had a lot in her last night. It was her night. And then you move on to the killers. They also were amazing in their performance. Uh, the American band with Brandon Flowers and Dave Kooning, they sold 15 million albums worldwide. So yeah, the Killers killed it. They did a great job in their performance. I love that, the Killers killed it. Yeah, and you can hear them. And <laughs> then moving on to Heidi Klum and Sai did the Gangnam Style, one of the cute moments, definitely seeing the two of them 
dancing it together. Wonderful. And we actually have a clip of that, so should we go and check it out? Yes, Heidi Klum and out. Sai going crazy doing Gundam style. Open Gundam style. is incredible. If you ever thought that Heidi Klum was just a pretty face, think again. She can do a pretty mean Gangnam style. Thank you so much to our Hollywood reporter, Jen Su, for that Thank great you. information. Thanks so much, Jen. Can't Thanks, wait to see you again. Ciao, ciao. Ciao, ciao. Wow, so great having, of course, a first-hand experience or an account of what actually went down at the EMAs. Thank you so much, Miss Jen Su. Now, Ewan is in the kitchen, and unfortunately, he's not doing the Gangnam style, but maybe he'll throw it in for us. Let's see what he's up to.